Okay then, ladies and gentlemen, um, I've been requested, uh, and I've, I've thought about doing it anyway, uh, but I'm going to show you how uh, to get around the whole uh, real player downloading MP4s that won't convert problem. Now, firstly, uh, the issue wasn't real player, it was Google doing something to be an arse, and it was making the MP4s that are downloaded incompatible with or media devices for some reason. Um, real player wouldn't play them, uh, like my mobile phone wouldn't play them, my PSP wouldn't play them, my list of my friends told me their iPhones and things won't play them. It's like they just weren't videos, just weren't actual videos at all, and they could not be played by anything. Uh, however, this solution, uh, well, this problem has been rectified. The only problem we have now is it's still downloading as MP4s, and you can see here MP4 format. But these ones are actually playable. However, that provides the problem that if you want to have this as an MP3, you can't convert it using Real Player. Not, not using conventional means, because the minute you stick it into real player converter and say convert, it would tell you you have to buy it. And you know, if you're one of these people that likes to use real player but can't afford to buy it or just doesn't want to buy it, then you know, you have to find some other way of doing it. And I came up with another way of doing it, and it does work. And uh, I've been requested uh, when I said I might make a video about it. Someone said, oh, yes, please. So, um, this is for you, uh, who said yes, please. And for anyone else who's just interested in a real player MP4 workaround. Basically, you open one of your folders. Uh, so, uh, this is my desktop, in case you're wondering what it was. If you, if you know what this program is, fuck well, yeah. You, so, you open your folder, and you, um, you go up to tools right up, it, right up here in the folder and you get the folder options you select the view tab and you deselect hide extensions for known file types you click apply and click ok and now you'll see that all the file files have mp4 in the end it tells you what they are now Just copy that one. Right. You go to rename, and we delete MP4, leave the dot on, otherwise you screw it up, and type in 3GP. And it will ask you if it wants to, if you really want to do this. Uh, MP4 and 3GP are basically the same, and uh, they're both mobile phone quality videos, but 3GP will be converted by real player. And since we only want the song, if it screws up the quality of the video, then it doesn't really matter, does it? Because we just want music. No, we don't want an actual video. And then my computer's decided to be a cunt and tell me it's switching to battery mode when it hasn't. Right then, so, here's our converter, just opened up. So, we take our... Feel it, the Tampere, feet Maya, dot 3GP file, and we stick it... into our converter. I've got it set to MP3, and I've got it set to save it my videos, so I'll, uh, we'll look at that in a minute. Here we go, video converting. Usually pretty quickly, it's just bringing, it's bringing a little slow because um, I'm recording. It's pain in the ass. Um, hopefully you've understood everything that I've done. Um, 
it's quite a simple thing really um, I don't know whether anyone else has thought of doing it or not um, I don't know what made me think of it right, so now I delete the 3GP video because I don't need it anymore we go to uh, my videos and there it is at the bottom and it should play perfectly fine Suddenly And there you go That's how you get an MP3 from a downloaded MP4 video, using still using real player. So basically, um, a lot of people commented on my on my video. Real player is fucked again, um, saying that. Uh, the real player uh, wasn't the problem, and that the problem was fucking what if it was, and all that shizzle. And uh, so um, I I checked that out myself as well because I didn't just you never just believe what people say about things, or check it out yourself. And so I checked it out myself, and it's they they were absolutely correct. And so, so basically, uh, it was YouTube, well it was Google, obviously, because they run YouTube now, and they're running it into the ground for some reason, and uh, Google just decided that it was them to fuck with something, and it screwed up real players downloading, but it is, um, so you're getting those broken MP4 videos, now the videos are still MP4, but they work perfectly, which is really annoying because of MP4s. People have been suggesting using other programs to download, like uh, YouTube to MP3 converters and stuff like that. But then I made the, I raised the question: What if you actually just want to turn it into a different quality video? Like if you want to turn it from, you know, a real player video to a Windows Media Player video, so you can stick it into Movie Maker and fuck with it. No, like I do sometimes, and they say, and they hadn't got an answer for it. So I somehow figured out that I could do this. Uh, I think I just tested the idea one day and realised it worked. And then I've been, you know, I've been doing it ever since. Uh, but basically, every time I've, I've like mentioned doing this to people. Um, they've all sort of gone, hey, do do what? You want me to open what and click what and do what? And I've gone, uh, 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 uh I've explained it again, like, uh, as, as simple as I can. <laughs> I mean, it's quite a simple procedure. But, you know, you know, just some people aren't as technical as others, if that's the right word to use. Um, I mean, an elite computer hacker, you know, will have known that in seconds, you know. Whereas, you know, I mean, I'm not an elite computer hacker. I, I'm not, well, I wouldn't even say I was an amateur computer hacker, <laughs> really. Um, but I did learn pretty quickly about how you can change files. That to stop people uh, finding stuff if they, you know, go through my system or whatever. I can change the format of uh, one thing to another. Like I've changed uh, pictures and videos into Microsoft Word files, and vice versa. I've turned uh, I've, I've, I've turned uh, audio files into text files, you know, like um, you know Notepad documents. And the only way you'd open them as music files would be to 
you know, right click them and hit open with you know, Windows Media Player and, that's, and it pops up perfectly fine. So if I just find these you know, files all over my system that, that don't do anything when you click them. <laughs> and they never ask me about it because then, I can, cause then I'll know they'll be going for my system. And then I can say, well, it says you have to go through my system, isn't it? But yes, that's how I've been getting around the whole MP4 to MP3 scenario. And yeah, if you want to fiddle about with your fucking documents as as, as much as I do, um, then you know, do so. You know, if you want to turn your music files into text files to annoy people, go for it. <laughs> it's gonna be fucking hilarious if you do. I wonder if you can turn them into text files. Open them with Windows Media Player. And add them to a playlist, even though they're still technically text files. Then have an entire playlist of just text files. That'd be fucking hilarious. People are like, where are you getting this music from for your playlist? Because you haven't got the files on your system. Was that her? Yes, I have. You just don't know where they are. <laughs> but I've been changing the formats of, of 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 things for fucking ages, basically. And I just thought, since 3GP is mobile phone quality, and MP4 is mobile phone quality, then maybe converting from one to the other in the, in the method I've been in the method I showed you. You know, turning these MP4s into 3 dps will actually work, and it did, the first time I did it, so I thought, well, fuck yeah. Then I tried converting it, and it worked, it's like, fuck yeah! <laughs> so there you go. That's how you sort your MP4s out, and that's how you turn them into MP3s. So, thank you for watching this informative video. And, in case you didn't know, that's charm. In case you've been sat there the whole video going, oh, oh god, what is that program? Oh god, oh god. Although, yeah, that's the latest series of Charm. I don't like the original woman, it was in it. The uh, fucking Pro. Is it Pro? Piper, Phoebe. Yeah, Pro. Fucking hated Pro. Because all her names down with P. For some reason. <laughs> yeah, Pro was the original one. She left for some reason. So you got Piper, Phoebe and um and the other one, I always forget her name. But you right, yeah, you know what I mean. So yes, try it yourself. That's not like Neil Buchanan again. Try it yourself. Convert a file yourself. Manual file conversions. You can't beat manual file conversions. Anyway Yes, so, hopefully this helped a lot of you with your MP4 to MP3 issues. And as long as you're not stupid, you know, it's a pretty good idea to leave the fucking option switched off. So that we constantly show you all this, just never accidentally delete it off the end. Or you get this. You ready for this? This is what you get if you accidentally delete it. It becomes a file. <gasps> Not a file. And no, before you ask, you can't just go like this. Because it would not work. <laughs> I will prove it. Bingo! File does not exist. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. And yeah, stay tuned for some more cool shit. Coming up soon. See you later guys. And girls.